Hey gang, Sally here. Hope you're having an awesome day. Uh, Kit and I just got back from our morning walk and we found this. I'll show you. Uh, we're going to roll the intro first and if you haven't already, please consider subscribing to the channel. If you think you're subscribed, <clears throat> double check to make sure you really are because YouTube has been spontaneously unsubscribing people. And while you're at it, give the video a like and uh, don't forget to leave a comment. So, let's get right into it. Roll the video. So, let's get right into it. Roll the intro. So, we just come back from our morning walk, and I see wet pavement in the area underneath the freshwater tank. So let's figure out what's going on with that. My rig was in the shop today getting something repaired. And when I picked it up this afternoon, it was 110 degrees inside. So that was pretty miserable. So I turned on the generator and the AC and ran those both with all the windows open to get all the hot air exhausted. And it's not bad now. So let me tell you what's going on. Um, in a previous video, I shared with you that I had a couple of uh, challenges to address. One of them was this skylight behind me. I'm going to show you that. That's all taken care of today. Super happy about that. Uh, the other one is the leveling jacks, and I don't think that's going to get taken care of, quite frankly. I'm going to call the place that I had them installed from and tell them what the problem is, ask them for an estimate on cost, and I'm pretty sure that this rig is going to be up for sale pretty daggone soon because I've got one picked out that I want to go get. And hopefully that all works out. We haven't quite worked out pricing yet, but I think we're going to get pretty close. So that's what's going on there. Let me show you this repair. Well, they didn't exactly clean the exterior or the interior, but what this had been was held in by duct tape. And uh, what had happened was um, the seal that holds the, uh, the skylight in place let go when I had been passed by a truck. So basically it was being held together with duct tape for about mm, a month. And it looks like they might have put a few extra scratches in right down here. That might come out. I'm just glad it's sealed back up and safe to drive again and not being held together with duct tape. So there's that. And as I said, I'm not going to, here, let me just, I don't remember if I've shown this off or not. I had this made when I was in Mexico in January. I really like the design. Um, hey, thanks for hanging out with me. Hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, if you did, I'd appreciate it if you subscribe, hit that thumbs up button, and always remember to sally forth, live your best life, Go out and adventure in whatever way works for you.